Good dag og velkommen, jeg heter Jacob Lee, and today I thought it would be fun to edit a photo on the Lightroom mobile app. Uh, I snapped one yesterday, and like I said in my last video, it's still uh, snowy outside, and so I'm just kind of doing some videos of doing stuff, chilling in the office, so... All right, so this is the Quattro badge on the back of my car. Uh, it's got snow and stuff all over it. I thought it would be really cool to get a photo like this because Quattro is the all-wheel drive system and it's got snow on it. So it's just kind of like one of those, uh, just one of those shots. So I'm just going to start playing around with it. Uh, drag the exposure down a tad. Contrast. Ooh, yeah, oh, I think I think higher contrast is gonna look good here. Yeah, drop that. Drop the shadows down. Yeah. White. That down blacks. Bring the blacks up, makes it look a little brighter. Bring them down, makes it look a little dirtier. Let's go. Right about there looks pretty good. Oh, that's hardly changing anything at all. Well. I double tap. Come on. There we go. Okay, color. What happens if we drag saturation down on there? Okay, so there's a little yellow in there. I'm just gonna drag saturation down to uh, zero because it's a uh, it's a gray car with snow and a black and silver badge. So just get rid of the color. Clarity. Clarity is. This is one of the situations where clarity might actually look good. Make it a little more gritty. Texture. Yeah, pull up the texture a little bit. Yeah, that looks good. Dehaze is another one that might look good on this one. Mm, don't want it too crunchy. That looks good right there. You know, I never usually do brighter vignette. But that actually looks good on this one. It kind of gives it the that kind of frosty, cold feel. I like that. Yeah. Uh, feather. Max out that feather. Let's... Yeah. Perfect. Mm. Yeah, okay. Grain. Let's see what grain does. Yeah, screw it. Yeah, let's put it on there. Why not? Detail. Masking. So when you mask, when you do a sharpness mask, it, as you increase the mask, it only selects higher and higher contrast areas. So in a photo like this, I mean, there's so much contrast because of the little flakes of snow. It's going to select just about everything. So I'm not... Mm, I don't know. That actually kind of looks good. We're just going going crazy on this one screw it why not uh, optics 
The lens correction, sure, why not? Chromatic aberration. Okay. I turn saturation down to zero, so. Okay. All right. Let's export to camera roll. All right, and you can see here, this is the finished photo. Uh, it's uh, off a 12 megapixel camera because it's an iPhone. Um, but yeah, overall, I think it turned out pretty good, especially for a mobile photo. Um, but thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy this quick little video, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.